For another challenge for Aurora police, the shooting yesterday at Nome Park that sent six Aurora Central High School students to the hospital. Police say two of them have a long road ahead as far as recovery. Nine News reporter Darius Johnson's with us now, and you've been pressing police today trying to find out more about their search for suspects. Hey there, Tom. You know, it's been more than 24 hours since this incident, and police have yet to release any information about those who they believe are involved at this time. Since the shooting, Aurora police have said that they'd release photos of vehicles involved to help to get the public's help in finding these people. Officers have been looking for those vehicles since the shooting happened around one o'clock on Monday. And at today's consent decree conference, Chief Wilson continued to stress that they need the public's help. The community has been very responsive. I know people are um, wanting to do anything and everything they can to, to um, support these kids and surround them with love, and we appreciate it. I need the community. People know what happened, and they know who did this, and I need them to come forward. So as of right now, just to be able to walk you through that again, we're still hoping to get those photos, photos of these suspects that they're hoping to releasing uh, to release rather. And also police are saying that they are working to find these vehicles on their own. Regardless, we will keep you all updated. But Tom, it is still sad to hear that two of those teens have significant injuries as well as a long road ahead. Yeah, certainly those those six that were shot have a long road ahead. But uh, I think a lot of people who go to that school uh, are also affected by yeah, it. And, and now they'll have a recovery as well. Yeah, I know earlier today they had um, enhanced or increased police presence out there at the campus and also near the park, but they also had counselors for those students as well. So we know it's something that's really impacting them, but also the parents and the people who live in that community. All right, Darius, thanks.